Today, we're diving into a topic that's crucial for any real estate investor, choosing the right property management company. Now, you might be wondering, why is this so important? Well, the right company can make your investment a breeze, handling everything from tenant issues to maintenance, while the wrong one can turn it into a headache. So, let's go. Hey everyone, I'm AK with the AK Realty Group, and I help people buy and sell investment properties all over the Dallas, Texas area. Let's get straight to the first question you should be asking the property management company. Question number one, what services do you offer? First up, let's talk about services. A good property management company should offer a range of services, but what exactly does that mean? Let's break it down. When we say full service management, we're talking about a company that handles all the day-to-day -day tasks of running your property. This includes finding and screening tenants, collecting rent, handling maintenance, and even dealing with legal stuff like leases and evictions. So now imagine having someone else take care of all of that for you. Sounds pretty great, right? Even with me being a realtor, I don't manage my own investment rental properties either, okay? I don't want to deal with all of that stuff. The property management company I use is awesome. Let me know if you want me to connect you with them, okay? Now, some companies go the extra mile, offering services like regular property inspection, financial reporting, and even helping you with tax preparation. These extra services can make a difference in making your investment smoother and more profitable. Question number two, how do you handle maintenance and repairs? Next, let's talk about something every property owner thinks about, maintenance and repairs. It's not the most exciting part of owning property, but it's super important. Regular maintenance is key to keeping your property in top shape and your tenants happy. A good property management company should have a solid plan for regular maintenance, like checking smoke detectors, servicing HVAC systems, and keeping the grounds looking nice. But what about when things go wrong unexpectedly? like say a pipe bursts in the middle of the night. You want to know how the company handles emergencies and how quickly they respond. After all, the faster a problem is fixed, the happier tenants will be and the less damage to your wallet. Question number three, can you describe your tenant screening process? Moving on to a super important topic, tenant screening. This is all about finding the right people to live in your property. Let's find out what makes the screening process effective. Why is screening such a big deal? Well, getting the right tenants means less hassle, fewer missed payments, and a better overall experience. A good property management company should have a thorough, a thorough screening process. This includes checking credit scores, criminal backgrounds, rental history, and even employment verification. It's like being a detective, but for tenants. But here's something just as important, knowing what to watch out for. Red flags in tenant screening can include things like history of late payments, a criminal background that could affect other tenants' safety, or inconsistencies in their application. Spotting these early can save a lot of trouble down the road, okay? Question number four, what is your fee structure? All right, now this is super important. Let's talk money, right? Specifically, how much it's going to cost you for these services. Understanding a property management company's fee structure is super crucial. Most companies will charge a percentage of the monthly rent, but this can vary. Some might have a flat fee. Others will charge depending on different services. So it's important to get a clear breakdown of all the fees involved so that there's no surprises. Remember, cheaper doesn't always mean better, okay? You want value for your money. And speaking of value, Let's talk about that. When evaluating costs, consider what you're getting for your money. Does the company have a great track record? Do they offer services that go above and beyond? Sometimes paying a little bit more can actually be a better deal in the long run if this means your property is in good hands. Question number five, how do you communicate with property owners? Last but not least, let's discuss communication. Staying in the loop about your property is crucial. So how a property management company communicates with you is super important. Good communication can take many forms. Some companies might send regular emails, others might have an online portal, and some might offer phone calls. What's important is that they keep you updated in the way that works for you. After all, it's your property and you should feel in control. But how often should you expect updates? And what kind of information should that include? Regular updates might cover things like the status of rent collection, any maintenance issues, and updates on the local real estate market. It keeps you in the loop, right? And helps you make more informed decisions about your property. 
And those are the top five questions you should be asking a property management company from services offered to communication methods. Remember, choosing the right company can make a world of difference for your investment. Okay, so take your time, ask these questions and find the perfect fit for your needs. As I mentioned earlier, I use a property management company here in the Dallas area that manages my properties as well as tons of properties for my clients. So if you want me to connect you with them, shoot me an email and I'll make the introduction. I've helped a lot of investors purchase rental properties in the Dallas area and I invest in rental properties myself. So if you're considering buying an investment property anywhere in the Dallas, Texas area, make sure you give me a call, shoot me a text or send me an email. I would love to help you come up with a plan that works specifically for you. And if you found value in this video, please give it a like, drop me a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you never miss out on any of my future videos. I'll see you on the next one.